Okay, so here's actually a pretty easy question. How would you like to receive a check instead of writing one to pay the electricity bill? Yeah, it sounds like a pretty good deal. The first person on Oahu to receive a check from Hawaiian Electric Company for energy he produced with his residential solar panels gave us a tour of his roof. He's going green and believes that his investment will pay off. Take a quick look at Kenneth Chang's roof and you'll notice he has more solar panels installed than most of his neighbors. My idea was to go through a, you know, one of those windmill type deals. And then my son said, you do that and your neighbors are gonna get excited. <laughs> so Chang first installed a net metered photovoltaic system in 1999 for $34,000. So you think it's worth it? I definitely do. I mean, I like paying $17 a month versus $200 a month. He then hired Revolusun this year for a bigger project. The feed-in tariff was first enacted for commercial use, but now we're using it on residential purposes. It installed the first residential feed-in tariff system on Oahu, which allows Chang to sell the energy his panels produce to Hawaiian Electric Company. Usually, it goes this way, mm -hmm. correct? Cool. But now you can see the wheel is going backwards. This is a win-win for everyone. With a net metered system, you get a dollar for dollar credit for the power you produce. And with the feed-in tariff system, it's a set rate. Last month, Chang received his first check from HECO for $1,344. He'll continue to receive checks for the next 20 years at a fixed rate, and then we'll have to renegotiate terms. He also had to pay $135,000 for the feed-in tariff system before government rebates and incentives. You get 30% from the federal for a tax rebate and the state will give you 35% of the, you know, the cost that you invest into the system. Okay. So you're getting about 65% tax write-off. And for the rest of us, we benefit by having more clean energy and it just takes us that much closer to reducing our dependence on imported oil. Revolution company officials believe that about 5% of their installations next year will be feed-in tariff systems like the one Chang purchased. HECO's spokesperson says there are 237 other residents who have applied for the feed-in tariff system.